Emporia State football's new receivers coach might be a familiar face for some. Bryce Chavis has his fair share of experience here in Northeast Kansas, and now he's ready to continue his young coaching career and get to work with the Hornets. Chavis finds his way up the middle for another score. You know, people have seen me grow up here, play here, and know how much football has always meant to me throughout my life. To, so just to get a great opportunity at you know, one of the top schools in the MIAA, man, I think there's just excitement. Bryce Chavis is no stranger to Northeast Kansas or the MIAA. I think he knows better than to wear any Washburn blue up here. Emporia State's new receivers coach spent four years as Riley County's starting quarterback and capped off his high school career with a Shrine Bowl selection. And I remember him when he played, I would describe him as a, as a very competitive, gritty, tough, type player. Then after two years at Butler made the move to Washburn where he spent the 2015 and 16 seasons as an all MIAA receiver eventually becoming a grad assistant. You know I kind of hurt my shoulder after that senior year um, when I was at Washburn and stuff and I kind of knew I wanted to get into it so you know right after I had surgery with that I talked to Coach Sherg over there and got into it and you know it's always been something I wanted to do. He then took his young coaching career south and spent the last four years as McPherson's quarterbacks coach and offensive coordinator. But now he's going to be a lot closer to his roots. Obviously being able to be close back to home um, for the people that watched me growing up to be able to come to games and do those things, it's, it's exciting. And of course that means he brings something extra to the table as a recruiter. Not only his familiarity with the MIAA, but just the state of Kansas, high school football in the state of Kansas, you know you're always going to recruit your backyard very, very hard. Um, I can familiarize with people in this recruiting process, what it's like to be a Kansas kid, go through this process, do the things um, that it takes to play at this level. Though the coaching lifestyle can often take you anywhere, Chavis feels lucky he's managed to stay in the Sunflower State so far, and he's ready to now be on the other side of the turnpike tussle. You know, being a part of a program that knows how to show up each and every week in a conference like this is special, and I'm excited to be a part of it.